I think it's important to remember that just because you have a Patreon, that doesn't mean that you can't do other things as well. I also have a YouTube channel membership because YouTube channel memberships offer you slightly different things. The members get special emojis, they get priority in the live chat, and they do really like that. So I do have that added to my YouTube channel. You have to have a certain amount of subscribers to get that added to your YouTube channel. It will just appear. It appears to be pretty random, but mine appeared around 20,000 subscribers subscribers. The reason why I prefer Patreon and I promote Patreon over YouTube channel memberships is that on YouTube it's just very very clunky. On Patreon you can see everything on a page, you just sign in and everything is there. On YouTube when you make exclusive content it just it just goes in with all the other videos. It goes on your community tab and unless somebody was really looking for it I don't feel like they would ever find that content. Another thing is that YouTube takes 30% of all of the money and Patreon 10%. So if you've got somebody on a higher tier, definitely worth sending them to Patreon. The benefits of YouTube, of course, is that the join button is right underneath your channel and it's very, very easy for you to use. When somebody joins a YouTube membership, it doesn't tell you that they've joined. There's no way that you can message them. So I just feel as though the experience for the members is better on Patreon and I tend to send people that way. But you can have both. They're both free to use, so there's really nothing to lose. There are lots of websites where you can do one-off donations. A very popular one is called Buy Me A Coffee. I tend to think of Buy Me A Coffee as being more for one-off donations, although they do have a membership option now, which is pretty similar to Patreon. They take 5%, Patreon takes 8%, so in that way, it's fairly comparable. I've found Patreon to be just a bit easier to use, and from the kind of purchaser's perspective, I prefer the experience of using Patreon, but there's no reason that you couldn't have both. I would try not to overwhelm your audience with a PayPal and a buy me a coffee and a Patreon and a YouTube membership, but if you had maybe one or two, I think that would be okay. The idea of buy me a coffee is that people buy you a certain number of things. So John bought you three coffees. I really like the idea of that, but I feel as though more people would do one donation and then be gone. It's quite a lot of work for them to keep coming back to the page and keep donating. You can do a similar thing with PayPal. I know a lot of people just have their PayPal link and if people want to do a one-off donation, they can. But when you do that, it very much is just money. There's no way you can really build a relationship there. There isn't a exclusive community. So you can have that. To me, I'm not so comfortable with that. I like to offer something back for the money, but it does work and it does work for some people pretty well. I know people who've had hundreds of dollars in just random anonymous tips just by having their PayPal in their YouTube description. It's not for me, but it might be for you. You of course could set up your own network. You could set up your own membership program and organize everybody coming in there. The thing that puts me off of doing all of that is that you would have to organize everything. You'd have to organize payments. You'd have to organize who can see what and I don't have the time for that. I use Patreon because it's incredibly easy. The page is there. Everybody can see what's on the page, but they can't actually see the post until they pay money, which I think is a very clever psychological trick. Nobody wants to miss out on things. And when they see a post that's just fuzzed out, it, it really does work and make people want to see it. They feel like they're missing out and they feel like they want to pay for it. Patreon is just a very, very easy website. If you're somebody who's really technical, who knows how to set up your own stuff, by all means, go ahead. But for me, a 10% fee is more than worth it to have Patreon handle all of that stuff. Patreon's also a really well-known brand. So when I send people to my Patreon, they know what to expect there. They trust it when they put in their card details, which I think is important because if you confuse people for a second trying to send them to your own network, you're going to lose them. So make it as easy as possible. And I would suggest sticking with a site like Patreon because it's just, they make it so unbelievably easy. Why not? There definitely are some things that could be improved on Patreon. I would like to see a one-off donation button on there. At the moment, you can't do any one-off donations on Patreon. It is only a monthly rolling subscription. So you'd have to do one month and then cancel, which isn't as good as a one-off donation. But the idea of Patreon is that you have Patreons and you have them month after month. So I understand why they don't have that. I would like to have the option of both, but Patreon's good enough. Maybe they'll change it one day, but not sure. 
I use Patreon above all of these others because it's just so unbelievably easy to use. It has a timeline in Patreon, which is very similar to a Facebook timeline so that everybody can see what is being posted. Everybody can talk to each other. I asked my Patreons recently what kept them in Patreon and a lot of Patreons mentioned other Patreons that they didn't want to leave because they had found friends within this community who had a common interest. For me, that's cruise ships. For you, it might be whatever your blog or YouTube channel is about. So definitely don't overlook the power of community. People like to be involved in something. And I found that Patreon puts everybody together very nicely. It's very easy to use. I've never had any complaints from anybody on the other side. And it's free to use, so that's why I chose it.